The movement for national reformation, MNR, has expressed the concern over the recent and bad governance protests in Nigeria, which have unfortunately resulted in violence, loss of lives and property damage. The convener of the group, Joshua Akun, while speaking with newsmen in Abuja, stressed that the federal government must prioritize the security and welfare of the people as mandated by the country's constitution and state policy principles. The organization extended condolences to the families affected by the unrest and called for immediate action to address the fundamental issues highlighted by the protests. Additionally, Akung stated the need for restructuring Nigeria based on true federalism, advocating or the restoration of the 1963 constitution to better address the country's governance issues. The federal structure, the federal tenets of that constitution are strong enough to hold our plural diversity together as one entity. Secondly, that constitution provided, uh, made sufficient provisions to deal with some of the challenges that we see today, such as agitations for water separation or whatever. That constitution made adequate provision for it. So the current realities will be what we already have as the starting point. So it's about going back to look at our plural diversity, make adjustments to suit what any ethnic nationality requires, homogeneous or heterogeneous. I will carry on. Nigeria was reformed upon the enactment of the Constitution, the Republican Constitution of 1963. Before then, it was a colonial Nigeria with colonial constitutions, about four of them. 1922 was the first one, with subsequent amendments in 46, in 1951, and 1954. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.